Hey friends, welcome back to the Gospel of Luke chapter 8 and verse 16 through 18 today. No one, when he has lit a lamp, covers it with a vessel or puts it under a bed, but sets it on a lampstand, that those who enter may see the light. For nothing is secret that will not be revealed, nor anything hidden that will not be known and come to light. Therefore take heed how you hear, for whoever has, to him more will be given, and whoever does not have, even what he seems to have will be taken from him. So, okay, yikes. No one, when he's lit a lamp, covers it or puts it under a bed, but he puts it on a lampstand so that everybody who enters can see the light. You, you have a light operat operating for a purpose, to give light. There's a reason why you have it going. God is giving his truth to us, not so that it can sit under a basket somewhere. He wants it to change the world. And so he's giving us things to change the world. Nothing is secret that will not be revealed. God is bringing illumination. His truth, his light uh, shines light. And when it shines light on stuff, you say, oh, look, at, I didn't realize there's that broken glass I was about ready to step in. There it is on the ground. I didn't see it before. But the light, because of the light, I can see it. So the light is good for us. It illuminates. It shows us the troubles that we're about to stupidly get into, and it shows the way. Nothing secret. There's nothing secret that won't be revealed or something hidden that's not going to be made known and come to light. God is going to shine his light on everywhere, every place, every nook, every cranny. Don't plan that you're going to sneak something by him or by anybody in this world because it's all coming out. All the things that have been, uh, the things we wonder today. You might wonder about uh, some of the medical treatments the last three years, or you might wonder about things that the global elites are doing or whatever. Hey, guess what? Someday you're going to get to look at the file. Someday you're going to see exactly what really was happening and, and whether you're, whether it was the way, the worst case that you thought it was, or even worse than that, or whether um, many things that we thought were happening weren't even happening. We were misled. That all is going to come out in the wash We'll be able to know it right now. We ourselves want to be agents of light, truthful, and when the truth comes out, may it be seen that our lives are all that we want them to be, all that you, all that God wants them to be, and all that you and I wish they would be, and God will bless that. It's interesting here how it says, be careful how you hear, because even if you, you know, you're not really on the team, whoever has to him more will be given, whoever does not have, even what he seems to have will be taken from him. Again, the light's going to shine everywhere, and Things that we thought were true are going to be revealed, some of it to be fakery all the way through. May we be truthful. Let's pray. Dear Father in heaven, thank you for hearing our prayers today. Help us to be right. We know the light's going to shine everywhere in every place, in every nook, in every cranny, even in our lives. And people will see one day, we'll get the file. Well, one day, everybody's going to see whether we were transformed by Jesus or whether we were just chattering into the air. Thank you, Lord, for hearing our prayers and work and change our hearts, Lord, so that what we have bears fruit. In Jesus' name we ask. Amen. And may God's blessings be with you today. And I hope you are benefiting from the gospel, in this case, the gospel of Luke.